back for episode three of Let's Play 3D.Game Heroes. This is Carl, and of course, this is Int Plus One channel. As an FYI, my voice is actually a little hoarse. I've been sick the past couple days, but I wanted to go ahead and still make some content, so <clears throat> I apologize if I don't sound like my normal cheery self. I think I will. I think I'm just going to sound a little squeaky, right? So if I squeak occasionally, I'm not a squeak toy, I'm still a person. Um, and what are we doing? Well, I loaded the game and it gave me the option to actually go ahead and change characters. So yeah, I do, right? I mean, it's fun to be an arcade machine, but why be an arcade machine when you can be a taco? So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to grab the taco character. We're going to do this as Taco Man. I think he was on the next last page here. So, all right, we got Taco Man. Heck yeah, this is okay. I want to be a taco. All right, so we're about to do the thing here. Now, the last time that we played this area, I died. Or, I played, I died of my own agency. We're gonna try not to die this time. It's a pretty easy little dungeon here, and I have a good feeling about our taco. He might be able to hang in here a little bit better than the arcade machine. So that's really cool. All right. So what do we got? We got a bunch of junk here, right? Die at the hand of my big sword. Look at me, I'm just wrecking things everywhere. What did I get, a, get a candle? Eh, eh, eh. I like that. We're gonna kind of blow through here. And I hate the idea of actually redoing it all. That's okay. All right, you know what? We don't even need to be in here. I'm gonna get those bats anyway. I need some coins. Look at all the money I have. It's totally the opposite of real life. 198 coins. Wonder what I can buy. Hmm. Who knows? Maybe I'd buy some salsa for my taco here. Is that a thing? Salsa on a taco? Maybe. Alright. Uh, probably taco sauce would be a little more appropriate. So, there. This ridiculously long sword. Okay, that's gonna try and shoot me with the. Ah, oh, no, no. Oh, it's small again. I like it when it's big and ridiculously powerful. Give me some hearts. Give me anything. Yeah, there we go. I'm good now. So I'm doing infinitely better. Um, so I'm feeling better. It's just all the crazy coughing has totally just wrecked my voice. Well, it could be worse. I could not be able to talk at all. This would be all like silent commentary. I don't even think that works, right? Like I can't be a mime and do a let's play. All right, so hold on. Where am I actually even going? Oh. Oh, great. So are there multiple levels too? I see all these symbols here. All right, so I need to go back towards the middle and to the right now. Oh yeah, that's right, I got a boomerang. Totally forgot about that. All right, Taco Man, do your thing. Kinda wish I could just warp to the front here. All right, where is that? Let's see. Let me look at my map again. Okay, yeah, I'm going the right way. At least I believe so. I'm either right or I'm wrong. See, when I'm not wrong, I'm always right. Yeah, there. Stand there. Take it. Take it. Take it. Okay. Now, did I go this way before? Yeah, I totally did. No! Ah! Look at that, they shut the door on me and everything. I mean, it's nice that they got the door for me, but uh, I didn't want to get in here. No. Here, have a boomerang. Ooh, coins. Oh, yes. So much more efficient. Oh, 
forget. I like that. Just take them out of my leisure. I'm not even gonna bother with him. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, that's what I wanted to do. Oh, it, it one-shots the uh, vampire bats. That's useful to know. Ooh. Nice. I'm gonna have to go all the way over there. Whoa, scorpions. No! Oh, wait, yeah, no, I still got my sword. Turn around, turn around. Thank you. Had a control snafu there. All right, so wait, where am I going though? Aha, I'm going to the place to do the stuff. No, I want my big sword. No, not fair. That's right, I do have a shield, don't I? Might as well use it. Of course, I'm right at the boss and I have, whoop. Master, listen. That switch looks like a little different or something. Should we push it? Uh, maybe. But let me go find a heart or something. I'm trying to get my heart on so I can get in there. Green apple. Nice. What does this do? It doesn't do anything. Okay. Ooh, the floor panel changed. <clears throat> <coughs> Terrible. Remember the one like it at the entrance? Yeah, it probably warps me there. Uh, let me not go there then. Unless, no, no, I don't want to walk through all that again, just on the off chance that it might do that. So I think it's boss time. I'm excited. Oh, look at that, here's our taco man. It's gonna happen. Is that meat? I don't even, I can't even tell what that is. Okay, all right, so. He's immune to the boomerang. That's good to know. Oh, are you serious? You must have noticed, Master. But it has a weak spot. Obviously, it's a tail. So strike from behind. Oh, well, actually, I, I didn't notice, but thanks. Thanks for the... Oh, yes! Look at that. Wait, wait, wait. Can I, can I deflect that even? Nope. Ah! Okay, I see. No! Ha ha, ha ha! Feel the wrath of my pixels. All right, so that's what I'll do. I'll just kind of be a creep and follow behind him. Look, got your tail, got your tail. Oh, are you serious? That was dumb of me. Oh, it gets faster. Wait, that's that's probably actually not good. Ah, there we go. Yeah, he does definitely get faster. Ah. It does more damage, too. Alright. I know he's just trying to get ahead in life, but I'm just trying to... Oh, does he flash? Or, like, at this point, is it just supposed to be obvious that that's where I hit him? Oh, that was cool. Hey, wait. Since when did I get, like, the lightsaber version? Yeah! Alright. Alright. We got an increase of our hearts. I mean, apples. Life up, get. Yeah! So grammatically correct. Let's put our verbs at the end of the sentence, just like it's Japanese. Huh, <sighs> you there. Did you and your fairy friend just defeat the snake? No, he just let us by. You know, he was like, whatever, I'm just gonna go sleep now. <sighs> Master Akado's sword play is remarkable. Of course we beat it. But, could you be one of the six sages, sir? Indeed I am. I am Sage Indy of the Grass Plains. I was reckless. I was captured by evil as I protected the orb. But thanks to you two, I'm safe from harm. Well, the king asked us to find the orb, so here we are. My stars, the legacy of the legendary hero. You are his descendant? How do you make that presumption? All right, yeah, but I am though, so thanks for noticing, I guess. 
I see it now in your face. I come from a long line of tacos. Actually, this is, this is just brilliant. That's right, Sage Indy. Master Arakadu is destined to save us. Indeed, I sense hope in your eyes. Here, take this item with you. Got the yellow orb. The orb contains magic greater than any magic one could find in two dimensions. The task of we sages is to entrust these magical orbs to a hero. The magic of the Triforce is yours, bearer of the hero's mark. Got a shader magic, parallax. Oh, that's cool. This magic will reveal hidden floor clu clu la 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 clues and the tabula rasa tablets. However, its use is limited by location. Cast it whenever you suspect that greater meaning lies hidden. Here, go and obtain the rest of the orbs for the peace of our kingdom. The rest of the sages will teach you the magic of their orbs. Thank you, Sage Indy, but where should we head to next? Hmm, make for the forest temple. To the northwest, you will find the forest of no return. Northwest, southwest, through the forest of maze. Through those cursed woods, you will find the forest temple. Northwest, thanks again, Sage Indy. Let's go, Master Arkadu. Good, good. I'm counting on you two. Oh, Master, have you noticed the E mark on the equipment in your menu? You can press the square button to equip or remove these items from your item reel. You want to be efficient? You can use L2 or R2 to cycle through items, yes? Try removing items you don't typically use for faster cycling, Master. Excellent. Can I talk to him? Yeah. The forest temple is a force of no return. Northwest of here. All right. Oh, look at that. I light up the room. Just at the right angle. Night. And I don't have to walk all the way out to the front door because we had the little warp thing. Oh. Okay. For a moment, I was faked out. I was like, wait, what's that? I don't remember that being there. Wait, let me just check it out, actually. Because that, that wasn't there, was it? I don't remember that being there. Revive the boss! No! Let's not and say we did. All right. <sighs> Let's go. Sliders. Okay, we're back. And what should I do? I should probably do the thing where I... Ah, I can't even see. I'm blinded by the lighting. Okay. Let's go ahead and let's save this. Lest something terrible happen. Mm -hmm. What's going on? And so, the young soul's adventure begins. Holding an orb in hand, fate whirls around the hero, bearing a burden of great responsibility. Come, start your journey. Return the light of peace to the kingdom of Dotnia. Or, you know, just play for fun. We could do that too. Oh, these guys though. Go away. Hey, do you like boomerangs? I love boomerangs. Boomerang! Oh wait, hey, he's at Northwest. So, like, I might need to evaluate which way I'm actually walking. Oh, and I'll tell you what, actually, that, that, oh, that Lost Kingdom, or that Lost Forest actually has some of my favorite music in this game. You know, it's irritating that when you take hits and you have less life, you're actually less powerful. It's kind of counterintuitive, like, hey, I know you had a hard time keeping all your hearts, so we're going to make it even more difficult by making your sword shorter. I mean, I get it, right? But... It just means that I feel like I have to just play perfectly and just not get hit. And I mean, a good part of like playing a game, right, is getting hit, right? Oh, no, I don't want to be here. This is different music, though, and I like it. All right. I don't know why I walked down, right? That's obviously not north. Here. Oh, yeah, 
that's right, I got a shield. I, I need to remember to use this. Hey, what's that? Hold on. That actually looked... Shoot. Well, I didn't notice that before. Kind of do want to check that out. We're going to explore a little bit, go off the beaten path. Might be worth our time. And get, like, some apple slices, right? That, that revives our health. Got this magic bar. I don't know what it does. Um, ooh, a bee! Oh. Oh, you're just as susceptible as the others. Oh, I can't, I, you know, I can't stop thinking about the uh, South Park episode, actually. Where, uh, well, you know, if you haven't seen it, actually, it's just, it's totally worth seeing. I don't want to give it away. It's like kind of a spoiler, but it's fantastic. This is just, you know, I, I, I should be crapping out rainbows or something. It's just amazing. All right, so let's talk to this guy. <sighs> Come back when you have a bow. Eh, eat boomerang. Fine, be that way. That'll teach me to be curious. Let's see if I explore your game. Oh, that's useful. Does that work with all enemies? Ha! <laughs> I got a trophy for just <laughs> stand there and get hit while holding your shield. We'll give you a trophy for it. Alright. I'm down with that. It's shake and bake, and I helped. Oh, ooh, another place. Are we gonna get disappointed here too? Wait, the heck? Is that guy okay? He looks a little dead. What does this place say? What does it? What's the sign say? Check. Development canceled. <laughs> what? <laughs> Writing on this floor. I'm in trouble. Please recommend this message. How? Oh, that is a Dark Souls. Really, Demon Souls reference. I love it. <sighs> yeah, I'm going to recommend that message. Someone was healed. Sweet. Okay. Oh. A mere corpse. Yeah, it's only merely a corpse. I <laughs> got a hero soul. Oh, snap. All right. Come on, guys. This game isn't that hard. There's something sticky on the ground. Got sticky white stuff. It really is. This is really a reference to, uh, to Demon Souls. That's amazing. The adventure begins, so to look back, do I press down? I don't know. Hey, uh, you should try jumping here, right? That's a message. Yeah, just, just try jumping there. That looks like a great place to go. I love this. From Cave. Oh my gosh, yes. It's the From Cave, as in from software. And it's just all like these meta meta references to, to uh, past properties. That's wonderful. I love this game's humor. It's just ridiculous and it's amazing and that's why I picked it up. All right. All right, let's go this way. I'm gonna spin around. I, I wish I could actually like charge it or something. Maybe that happens when I get like the master sword equivalent. If I press, all right. If I press L1, I get a map. Hey, there's like an inn apparently this way. That's interesting. I don't know why there'd be an inn like right in the middle of the woods. Yeah, let's go there. There's surely like safety here, right? Probably. I'm gonna save anyway. Wardna's house. Okay. We're gonna go say hi to Wardna. And I'll tell you what, actually. With that, I wanna go ahead and uh, end this episode. We're hitting the 20 minute mark, and I know me. I'm gonna wanna do another one, and I'm gonna wanna make sure that everything goes off without a hitch, actually. So, do me a favor. If you enjoyed this, subscribe. If you didn't enjoy this, don't subscribe. And you know what? I don't even care. You don't have to watch any more videos, but I hope you enjoy it, right? Go ahead and subscribe. Maybe hit the like button. Uh, visit me on Facebook. Uh, berate me on Facebook. Do any of those things, right? That sounds like fun. So go ahead, and I hope to see you next time. All right.